Well, it has been four years since the killing of two neighbors inside the Bushwick houses in Brooklyn. And to this day, no arrests have been made. But tonight, a $50,000 reward is being offered for information that leads to the arrest of whomever committed this horrific crime. And News 12's Katie Lusso spoke with investigators both from the NYPD and the FBI, along with the daughter of one of the victims who all want the same thing, justice. These weren't, you know, criminals. Two innocent people. These weren't people who were involved in dangerous activity. Living their lives. People were going about their lives, minding their own business. Murdered inside their own homes. Which is a crime that everyone is afraid of. Four years later, the question remains why, with both the FBI and the NYPD both trying to find that answer. What happened to these two people who did nothing to bring this to their doorstep? On May 11th, 2018, Anna Del Valle was found inside her fifth floor apartment here at 140 Moore Street, dead. Two days later, her next door neighbor, Basil Gray, also found inside his apartment dead. But police tell us they believe both of them were killed on the same day. No eyewitnesses, no 911 calls, limited forensic evidence. Over the years, they've looked into numerous leads. What we began to discover was that there may have been a nexus to the drug trade involved in 140 Moore and the surrounding housing project. While it was not connected to the victims themselves, we believe that that was somehow the impetus for what happened. At one point, this cell phone footage released, believed to have been recorded around the time the two were killed. The NYPD is already offering a $20,000 reward for info leading to an arrest and conviction. Now the FBI has tacked on a $50,000 reward for information leading to the arrest of the person who did this. Worked very hard to uh, vet every lead. And it's come to a point now where we feel like information from the public would help us put those last pieces of the puzzle together. FBI special agent in charge Matthew Brodak says no tip is too small. What is insignificant to them is very significant to us and could be that little piece of the puzzle that could put it all together for us. It's painful every day. Anna's daughter was the one to find her mother on that horrific day. She said she's hopeful that this increase in reward money will help find the killer. I can understand they're, if they're scared. You know, these people have no remorse. Try to put yourselves in our shoes, knowing that these people are still out there. Both agencies maintain this case is not cold. This case is not closed. We want the families to know and the public to know. We have multiple persons of interest that we're looking into, and what we need is for people to come and talk. Anna's daughter says while nothing can bring her mom back, you know, no money in the world is going to ever bring her back. We just hope that this time around, you know, people will come forward, and that's all we're praying for and hoping for. We want justice for our mom. Justice for both Anna and Basil. Katie Lasso, News 12. Now, if you want to know how you can help break the case, if you've got any information, take these numbers down. You can call Crime Stoppers at 1 800 577 TIPS or contact the FBI directly at 212 384 1000.